So you want to promote some CP8 offers using Google Ads? You are in the right place, guys. I'm going to be showing you what we can do to improve our sales, speaking about the CPA offers. So CPA is an amazing place of performative marketing. So if you want to customize, if you want to make an affiliation of a specific program, do you want to just make, of course, the promotion of that thing in order to have uh, commissions, preferables, affiliation, and all that. So here into my actual uh, CPA grip, uh, I do have an account where I am receiving a lot of offers. So uh, what I'm going to do here is to go into my actual uh, offer tools, get hit into my offers. So I just want to show you uh, a few examples of specific CPA um, stuff here. So as you can see, we do have different uh, CPA here. For example, let's say I'm going to go into country, I'm going to type for United States. We want to go into the old categories show status and go into search so for example here i do have different banners like enter for winning ten thousand dollars now so i'm going to click in here and this is what's going to be happening here for each person who clicked in here i'm going to go into the tracking domain copy the link here um for each person who entered the information for example here just an email sub submit i'm going to be earning two dollars so that means that if I'm going to go and open really quick my calculator here, I have 2.06. If I make that 150 people do this uh, stuff, I'm going to be earning $300 only for people to doing that. So what I want to do is to make, of course, make use of Google Ads. So this um, this ad can be appearing into a lot of people. So let's say that I want to use this money. I want to invest, let's say, uh, only fifty dollars of ads. And with that being said, I'm going to be earning two hundred and fifty nine dollars. Still, I'm earning a lot of money. So I have now. Uh, a budget so I can start making money here. So what I want to do is to hit into the X mark. I want to copy this link and I want to paste that to see how it's going to be looking my actual uh, my actual offer. So sometimes this really depends into where you're currently living. I'm currently into the Latin America and if you, and if you can see guys here, uh, this actually appears into Spanish and it's actually another offer. So uh, we, we have to of course have a name and an email to in order to participate. So I'm going to go into the X mark and I'm going to go into Google Ads. Here into Google Ads, or you can go into the ads.google.com. What you want to do is to confirm a payment method. You want to confirm a user information and how would you like to get paid. Go into the submit section so you can start working here into the Google Ads. So once you are here into Google Ads, what I want to do is to switch and use another account. So I'm going to use this one. I'm going to hit into the X mark. And what you want to do is to start by creating your first ad campaign in order to have the optimizations here. So how can you get started here? What you want to do is to go into new campaign that appears into the overview like this. And here, what I want to do is to look out for any specific objective. So we do have, for example, sales, leads, web traffic, product and brand, campaign, local store app and brand awareness. So what I do want to do is to look out for some conversions that can be helping me to customers take action and I want to um, track that event. So here I think like the best option for us that would be the leads. Get leads and other conversions by encouraging customers to take action. So I don't want people only to visit my website. I want to track people to click into this link and submit their information. So what the Google Ads is going to be helping me with is to give me all the information of all the people who did the actual event and I can look out, I can make Google Ads to look out for more potential people that can do exactly the same thing. So I am optimizing my money in order to have more um, more results. So you want to go into the leads and here I want to go into the page views and here's the conversion of a website and conversion actions. So I want to go into the ad goal, engagement, and here when it says YouTube hosted, uh, I'm going to go into the three dots and you want to restore depending on what you're actually looking for. So I can restore my Google account here. I'm going to go into the one action here. I'm going to remove this page views. 
Um, there we go. So I'm going to just delete this and hit into continue like that. So now it's going to be asking, like, how would you like to get this campaign? Like in the discovery section, in the video mode, in the searched, in the performance max, in the display, in shopping. So I do love to use to run some ads using the YouTube Gmail and discovery section. Sometimes the video and the performance and the display, sometimes it just won't work because people are watching videos in YouTube. So I think that it's not, not that worthy. So we leave it into discovery. And here, this is the web page. People will go after clicking your ad. So with that being said, I'm going to go back here into my CPA offer. I'm going to copy this one. I'm going to paste that into my business website. And the campaign name is going to be added, let's say, for example, CPA offer number one. And I'm going to go into continue. Now, uh, the bridge that you can part of the ad is going to be not that hard. What you want to do is to measure the actual action. So we do have one conversion action uh, enabled that. So we're going to go into fix it. So here into fix it, what I want to do is to uh, create a new conversion action. And here I want to look out for website. And I want to go into this website domain. I want to scan this and now I want to of course get the instruction and finished. So which address would you like to use this one or this one? So you want to choose this one that says cost um, preferable, create conversions. So I'm going to get into the create conversion goals. I want to go and look out for purchase, for example, and choose match types URL starts with and I'm going to paste that or let's say contain or is going to hit into add and there we go now I'm going to add another event I'm going to do exactly the same thing let's say sign up choose RL starts with and hit into add so of course I just want to add one of those hit into save and continue and now what I want to do is to go into settings and try to make the conversion happen here into my actual uh, into my actual website. After you have done that, I want to go into the X mark and still look out for the actual overview of my campaign. So I can go here into campaigns. Here I have uh, this campaign created. So you can go into create campaign and do exactly the same thing if you want to just get started. So after you have successfully done what we just did before, is just to go into, I'm going to hit into discovery really, really quick. I'm going to hit into continue. And what you want to do is to go into the budget optimization, what money you want to spend here into the average that you want to do. You want to go, let's say, for example, um, two dollars per week and you want to enable the conversions. And it's very important to try to improve the location where you want to send this. For example, here, this one is only for the United States. So I just want to go for another location and only for United States. This is my main target only for this guys. And here in the languages, I want to look out for English conversions. And here's my budget. After that, you want to go into next. Here is your audience. You want to create a new audience and you want to specify the type of people who are more likely to type into this ad. For example, people who are more than 40 uh, for age 40, 40 years old or less than 20 years old, depending on what you are trying to uh, sell and uh, what is the offer of CPA. After that, you can go into continue and your ads should be running right away. So this is how we can get started into the Google ads. You can track your ads here into your overview and your insights and the recommendations is going to be appearing as you are creating more and more um, optimization campaign. So that's how we can get started to import some CPAs into Google Ads and we can have more improvement, more recommendations, insights, and we can spend less money and get more results. So with that being said, guys, we have reached into the very end of the video. Thank you so much for watching the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. Hopefully you're doing so well with this great conversions. So thank you once again, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. I'll see you soon, guys.